And welcome back guys, we're going to be playing some more Fallout 4, make sure it's the like button, make sure it's the subscribe button, let's get back into it. Honored to have you here, ma'am. done. Just need to tighten up this primary drive servo. Hey, Doc. It's the third primary drive breakdown this month. They weren't kidding. You really are here. Well, uh, when Father told us about... If you don't... I just wanted to find my son. And keep him safe. Now that you've found him, now, I'll give you a quick rundown of the facilities to visit. As you might guess, we, sure. we maintain enough... Right. There's a lot of uh -huh. the work we do, so... Absolutely. Huh. Take your time. If there's anything else... Uh -huh. It must be a challenge. To Absolutely. We scratch and scrape for every precious ounce of voltage that we can. Over the years, we've learned a few tricks that help supplement our power budget. When necessary, we can tap into select sources on the surface. We take only what we need, of course. Fortunately, Advanced Systems is always working on new solutions to generate more energy. It's a good thing, too, because the demand is always increasing. <laughs> you don't even want to know what a single use of the molecular dematerializer consumes. Oh, I don't know. Most of them have... 
lasted long past the projected lifespans. If you ask me, they're still as well. I can't argue with that. Even so, I'm ready to see the full gym. So, long past it. You wait for the future. Is it true food supplement 77 has been discontinued? That is correct. That was my favorite one. I will be happy to forward your request to the bioscience department. Hey, it's me. So you're the one who sent the encrypted message. How did you even do that? I wasn't sure anyone on the surface would have a chance to crack Trinity. You know, the encryption algorithm. A friend named Tinker Tom cracked your encryption. He must have had some serious hardware to pull that off. Wow, your message was only one word. Friend. What did you mean by that? Is that what it said? The railroad didn't bother telling me. What? The railroad? As in THE railroad? I kept sending sins to the surface hoping someone would help them. I hoped the railroad got to some of them, but I never knew for certain. You've saved a lot of sins. So much to take in. But wait, with you in the picture, I have this idea to rescue a lot of sins at once. But we'll need help. Where's he working now? Right. Let's go to the West Atrium. Probably best to talk about something else right now. You know my father thinks it's a living hell on the surface. But that can't be right. Heck, you look positively normal to me. Uh, no offense. I'm not sure if we could ever make the surface actually a decent place to live. That doesn't mean we shouldn't at least try to help, you know? Z-114, it's me. Sir, do you require something? It's okay, Z-1. She's a friend. She's with the railroad. Meeting here is dangerous. And you bring a stranger. You. How do I know we can trust you? Because the members of the railroad have dedicated their lives to fight for your freedom. I... I thought only Mr. Benet cared. But your friends actually fight for us? That's what the railroad does, Z1. She's from the surface. I've never met another human willing to help. But, sir, we must make this quick. Right now, how many synths want to escape, Z1? The ones I know for certain? Thirteen. That'll take forever. Let's free those thirteen all in one go. I would do anything for my people. But how do we get them to the teleporter? It's no good. The old maintenance tunnels that lead there are always sealed. By the SRB. Hmm. If I can find a way to open those doors, could you get your synths to the teleporter room? Yes. We'll talk later. Someplace more secure. Just a few high security doors, right? Controlled by cutting edge SRB security tech. Yeah. A head on hack is the sucker play. So we go at them sideways. You're willing to help, right? I can't do this alone. Of course I'll help you. Our core security architecture hasn't fundamentally changed from the old CIT days. The original security program was called Code Defender. Revolutionary stuff. We still have terminals running version 1, mothballed in storage. With some persuasion, I can get an old terminal to interface with the new security terminals. Enough to open doors, at least. Problem is, I can't even crack version 1. So I need a good old-fashioned username and a password. And that's nowhere to be found in the Institute. But if you could get me a pre-war admin password from the surface, I could log right in. I'll find it for you. That's great. Unfortunately, the obvious place to look won't work. The CIT ruins were picked clean years ago, but some of the admins had to live off campus. Ask your friends in the railroad. I need those login credentials.
been reviewed. I wonder how the Welcome. Warwick family is doing. So good to have you here. Young Dr. Wally Clayton must be close to 10 years old by now. It's remarkable that any child can survive for I so look long. Forward to In that case, as the name, uh -huh. our most important direct to that end, we've even started. You probably saw the gorillas. Sure. Seems like there's hard work, and I'm sure I've taken up a. I'm not sure how well I'll fit in. Great. In any case. Right. I'm good for now. Thanks. Take care then. You. You're here then. Yes, yes. I know who you are. Don't worry. I promise I won't get in your way. Thank you. I do it. Oh, before I forget, let me see that pit boy of yours. I've been told to install a courser chip. You're to be given full access. Thank you. I'm sure that will come in handy. Given that the relay is the only way to access the Institute, handy is something of an understatement. In case the significance is lost on you, you'll be the only one here with that kind of access. If nothing else, it should demonstrate the amount of trust Father has placed in you. Now, unless there's something else, I really do need to get back to work. I'm good for now. Thanks. All right. Yeah. Personnel only. So Dr. Ayo thinks he can hide in his office, does he? Well, you can tell him that we I intend to speak to Father. Are you serious that we can be heading over to robotics to knock some heads together? What now? Let's carry ready. on, ma'am. You're here. Upgrades, I Glad you made it. You guys should take some <laughs> We're all looking ready. forward to working with you. Please don't. There's enough friction as it is between us and pretty much all the other departments. Hi, you Doc. soft on me, Alana? So... Here you are. Justin Ayo, acting director of the Synth Bridge. I'll be up front with you. We're going to be keeping a close eye on you for the near future. Uh -huh. Despite your relation to father, uh -huh. I'm sure you understand. Why? Don't you trust me? I'll be honest. You're an outsider. The first outsider to be allowed access to the Institute in quite a long time, in fact. There's little precedent for this situation, so it's only natural to take extra precaution. Hmm? It's nothing personal, I assure you. Now, Father has asked that I provide you with a brief overview of the synth retention kit. Our primary responsibility is the recovery of escaped synths that are hiding among the human population on the surface. Why would synths want to escape? Synths do not want. They might look like human beings, but they're machines. As to why they're escaping, that matter is currently under investigation. Our main instrument is the Courser, a third-generation synth assigned to operate on the surface. Coursers hunt down and reclaim synths that have escaped the Institute. They are highly self-sufficient, trained in combat, infiltration, and tracking. In a word, our Coursers are relentless. But I gather you know all this, since you've encountered one already. In fact, I'd very much like to know how you defeated it. I'm no stranger to combat. Even so, a Courser should be more than a match for any single combatant. I suppose I'll have to ask Robotics to perform detailed diagnostics on the entire production run. As if we don't have enough workers. Now, unless you need something else, I'll get back to work. I'm good for now. Very well. Hey, it's 
It's Fixer. Fixer's back. Was power napping and whammo it hit me got some ideas on how to kid out deliver make your super bad ass gun even more well more so check maybe later <laughs> sure man Pam wants you those balls she explained why you just tomorrow keep you. I <gasps> thank god Woo! see this i told you the molecular stabilization made itself funny you didn't sound certain yesterday it is really, really good to see you. Did it work? Did you make it inside the Institute? Yeah, I got there. And the Institute is paradise. Healthy people, clean, plenty to eat. The paradise built on the backs of slavery is no paradise at all. In Tom's hollow tape, did you make contact with Patriot? I met Patriot. His name is Liam Benet. I knew you'd get the job done. We need every scrap of intel you picked up in there. Write up a full report on Pam's terminal. After you're done, we'll analyze it and figure out the next step. Get to it. <laughs> Take your time to cook it Confirming presence of rogue variable. Dispensing data. There are three independent reports of coarser activity. Glad you signed on. Pam. Preliminary analysis complete. Anything we need to move on. Affirmative. Code name Patriot. Requires admin credentials for Code Defender Security Software. Cross-indexing CIT Security Administrators with 2077 Commonwealth Census Records. Filtering by surviving structures. One match found. Bergman. Wilfred. Bergman. Wilfred. Registered as co-owner of Cambridge Polymer Labs. Estimated 81 percent chance of login credentials being located at this facility. What can you tell me about Cambridge Polymer? Cambridge Polymer Labs, LLC, had several active military contracts specializing in robotics. The region is currently classified as extremely dangerous. After you get the password report back here, with any luck, we'll have a game plan by then. Welcome to the Cambridge Polymer Labs. Employment opportunities await in the field of scientific research. Shall we begin your application now? Sure. I'm game. Let's begin the interview. Due to increased demands for staff in all fields, we have condensed the employment test accordingly. Question one. Do you possess previous experience with polymer synthesis? 
Sounds like you need me regardless, so let's get down to brass tacks. Calculating test results. I am pleased to offer you the position of sales coordinator. Expect a loquacious future in haggling for no... Would you like the orientation before beginning your work in the labs? No, let's just move it along. Due to staffing needs, we can forego the orientation at the... Please follow me to the research lab so that you may begin your work. Complimentary beverages are provided for employees. Please label any food or cigarettes you leave in the break room. Sales staff are provided with a business suit. The cost of which will be deducted from your first commission. Please take a moment to dress in your proper work attire and follow me into the clean room. The research staff will greet you on the other side of the clean room. Thank you for your attention and welcome to the team.
of you know this already, but something so big. I can't ask people to keep it secret any longer. The rumor is true. One of our agents has made it inside the Institute. Is this what Tinker Tom was working on? Yes, Tom's work is related, but the device and the assembly was the Wanderer's doing. After the device was assembled, she made it inside the Institute and then back out. Where is the Institute? We're not sure exactly. Best guess is that it's somewhere under the old CIT. But they've been using a teleportation device to get in and out, so it could be anywhere. What did she find out? I know you all have questions, but I've said everything I'm going to. But know this, the ops you're planning and running now are the most important of our lives. We have a chance at rescuing more since than we ever dreamed of. So get it done. Then Excellent work. Well. On our side, we've gone through your report. It was extraordinary. So many pieces of the puzzle clicked into place. Our final analysis indicates the Institute is far more formidable than we ever feared or imagined. If we stage a mass breakout, Patriot's 13 synths will undoubtedly be the last we ever save. Instead, we use this one chance to rescue all the synths. Every last one of them. That's a bold plan. We can't waste this opportunity. The Institute will never let their slaves go without a fight. So the heart of our problem is manpower. Even if we call in all our agents, and we will, we won't be able to hold our own against the Institute for long. Talk with C-114. If the synths down there want freedom, they must fight and risk their lives to earn it. Z1 seems capable of that. We always thought Patriot was the savior of the synths, but it may be more accurate to say that Z1 is. As much as we owe Patriot, we can't be certain how committed he is. If he learns we're willing to kill to free synths, he may not have the stomach for it. So get what you need from him and then cut him loose. Good luck. We're all with you. Good to see you. Must be quickly. We cannot risk being discovered. I have made arrangements. I can get the 13 discussed into position. But tell me, do you think Mr. Benet's plan will work? A better plan is to use this opportunity to rescue everyone. But since we'll have to fight for it. And I thought Mr. Benet's plan was too ambitious. Of course, I'd fight for my freedom. I know of a few others that might as well, but enough to face all the guards? Perhaps if we stand up openly to the scientists, more of my people would join us. Yes, even if most don't join the fight, certainly there are many others who have been waiting their whole lives for this. But we should be prepared for some of the synths to fight against us. You won't be alone. The railroad will fight with you. Together? We have a chance. I admire Mr. Beignet a great deal. We can't tell him about this plan. It's his people we'll be fighting. I will talk to my friends. Meet me here tomorrow. If I don't make our appointment, assume the worst. Synth unit, you were scheduled for maintenance duty in SRV last night. Anything you'd like to report? Nothing to report, sir. I carried out my duties, as usual. Dr. Ao saw you accessing a terminal. You know you are not permitted to access terminals in that section. Is Dr. Ao mistaken? Yes. I mean, no, he's not. But I was only... What is it? Were you or weren't you accessing a terminal in SRV? I was, but I swear it's not what it sounds like. I was cleaning the terminal and it, it switched on by mistake. I was just shutting it down. Was that a stutter? Have you developed a defect, unit? Maybe you need to be reset. Sir, I assure you that won't be necessary. It won't happen again. See that it doesn't. 
You don't want me to tell you twice. Now get back to your duties. You get me what we talked about, and I'm in business. Liam, I got you your username and password. You railroad guys really deliver, you know? Hooking that ancient tech up to the modern terminals is going to be seriously time consuming. Even with that password. So hand it over and I'll get started. This is a delicate operation. Are you okay if we have to use violence? Good question. If we find ourselves in that position, we pull the plug and wait for another opportunity. We can't risk anyone's life over this. Great. Listen, I need a favor. Z-114 is working the atrium again. Can you give him an update? It's safer if you do it. Hi, miss. Hello. Please ensure that your dietary requirements are being filled. I wish you could have known father as we have. Just as you gave life to father, he gave life to many of us. See one? I asked my friends if they'd take up arms for their freedom. I was surprised at the number of volunteers. Perhaps once the fighting begins, many others will join us. But we will fight and die very quickly unless we have weapons. A lot of them. Given the right materials, we can make our own crude but serviceable weapons. Unfortunately, we're missing a few critical ingredients. What ingredients? Gunpowder, laser focusing crystals, and a couple other things. Steal some weapons. All munitions are tightly guarded by the SRB. Even if we manage to take some, it would certainly be noticed. And surprise is essential to everything. Go on. The Institute's always expanding. Excavation just completed on one of the sublevels. The mining equipment has been packed into crates and they haven't been moved yet. That equipment has everything we need. And thanks to Mr. Binet, the construction crew is populated solely by my friends. But, they're under constant supervision. How do you feel about killing some guards? Who's guarding them? A good number of early models since. Will that be a problem? I'll do it. Thank you. After you eliminate the guards, we'll move the supplies and blow up the tunnels behind us. To the SRB, it will be a tragic construction accident that killed many since. Rare, but not unheard of. And then, our dead friends can assemble the weapons we need. Good luck. Remember to keep unnecessary power consumption to a minimum. Don't recharge. Sir, we've had another situation. A code red. What? Third time in two weeks. This is unacceptable. How could this happen? We think there was a system glitch. We're looking into it. Damn it. You're all useless. I'll figure out what happened. In the meantime, tell the others to be on high alert. I want more patrol, more rounds. Right away, sir. If you see anything remotely suspicious, report it to me.
Scanning. Subject identified. Please direct all inquiries to G981. Tell Z1, we will fight when the time comes. We have little time. It is best you go, for your sake. Construction will begin immediately. This is a good start. The greatest challenge remaining is keeping all of this secret from the SRB. So we're being very careful, which unfortunately takes time. For now, please continue working with Father. We can't afford for him to grow suspicious. When my people are ready, I will contact you. Now that you've had a chance to see the Institute firsthand, what do you think? You've got technology here that I never dreamed possible. I'm glad you can appreciate what we've accomplished. None of it has been easy. Ultimately, all our knowledge and resources are focused on a single goal. The goal is best summarized by our motto. Mankind. Redefined. Unfortunately, no advancement comes without occasional setbacks. As remarkable as our synths are, they can be... dangerous without proper supervision. The superior synth mind and body attempting to wrestle with something approaching free will can be a recipe for chaos. What do you mean by proper supervision? I mean that while they are here in the Institute, fulfilling the purpose for which they were designed, our synths perform admirably. As you're about to see, however, they can become unpredictable when set loose 
A rogue synth has taken over the Raider Gang at Libertalia. His memories have been erased, and his identity altered. He believes he's a man named Gabriel. Under his leadership, the Raiders have taken many innocent lives. I've dispatched a courser to Libertalia. I'd like you to join him and reclaim that synth. Who erased his memories? And why? Those idealistic radicals who call themselves the Railroad are behind it. We'll deal with them in time. But right now, the priority is to reclaim that synth before more harm is done. Now you should get moving. Many people are in danger, and a delay could cost lives. Alright, that looks like a good place to stop. Make sure to like the like button, make sure to subscribe button. I'll see you guys in the next video.